Family, what's good? Rebel Gang, what's up? It's your guy, Matt the Rebel, back with another video for you today. It's a beautiful afternoon, beautiful evening now in Washington, D.C. And as you guys already know, family, as you already know, it's always, and I mean always, a great night, great afternoon, great time to talk about sneaker pickups, man. And I was able to day family today being December 17th, 2021. I was able to actually catch a retail pickup of two shoes that two, well, let me, let me backtrack two colorways of the same shoe. One of which I really wanted for myself, wasn't able to get it in my size. Other of which I was able to get it in my size, but my homie, I would rather him have it because this colorway just really isn't my thing, but I know he'll be able to pull it off without a doubt so family with that being said let's go ahead and get in today's review let's go ahead and get into today's video of both colorways of the yeezy 450 dark slate and the resin started with the video family in its entirety I always have to make sure I shout out our new rebels man our new family members our new subscribers family welcome to the channel welcome to the most lit family on all of YouTube we engage and talk about sneakers all the time man and starting in a few weeks or so we're gonna be getting into that fashion bag a little bit too yes you always see me wearing black tees in my black rebel hat we're gonna start changing it up a little bit. We're gonna come with the fits, man. We're gonna start coming with the different looks and styles and everything in between, family. So make sure you are on the lookout for that. Of course, if you're new, if this is the first time you're ever seeing a Rebel Gang video, make sure you hit that subscribe button, hit that like button, comment in the comment section. Share this with your mom, your pops, your, your po little pookie, little Ray Ray, grandma, little cuckoo, and grandpa. Share it with the whole family. Anybody who you think may even have a smidge of an interest in sneakers, family, make sure you share Share this channel with them. We are on the road to 2,000 subscribers, man, so let's get to it, family. All right, so I'm not even about to sit up here and try to talk your head off about this sneaker and that sneaker, this Yeezy, that Yeezy. The Yeezy 450 Dark Slate and the Yeezy 450 Resin. Now, a few moments later here's the thing about the dark slate and the resin yeezy there's nothing wrong with them i actually am a fan of the 450s i have the cloud white pair personal pair in my size man i am an absolute fan of this shoe now i've actually worn the four i've actually worn the cloud white ones i think i've worn them once or twice already extremely comfortable extremely durable as you already as you guys may or may or may not already know you got that ortholite technology on the bottom of the shoe and that is the exact same thing that you are getting on the dark slate and the resin, okay? There's no difference. Only difference is the colorway. With regards to the resin, all right, now this colorway isn't really a shoe for me. It's like that dark green olive type of look to it, man. It's a really clean shoe, but for me, it's just not something that I could see myself wearing. So this pair is actually going to one of my brothers from another mother. His name is Milton Chavis. He is basically, if you guys know anything about basketball content, his IG is MDW Basketball. He's literally taking over the web right now with his travel or not series and breaking down the rules of the game from the professional level all the way down to the amateur level so family make sure you guys follow my guy milton chavis aka mdw mr mdw himself man he is the one who i was actually able to cop this shoe for so this shoe is going to be going out to him i'm not saying i can't pull these off let me not say that but when it comes to shoes that i particularly wear this just really isn't my thing this colorway okay now it's it's clean it's nice I just don't see myself wearing it and I don't see it on my foot, but I know Milton knowing how his, knowing how his style is He's gonna crush these with regards to the dark slate though Now this is why I was a little upset today family and of course man Let me not even say I'm upset shout out to Atmos USA for the crazy shot drop I was actually able to go in and cop both pairs, but I gotta say man I was heartbroken when I got to the front of the line and They didn't have that 13 because I was gonna get the 13 in the dark slate for myself for my toe because I have the cloud 
white pair. I love the white pair, but I've been hunting for the dark slate pair at retail. Of course, um, if I have to pay resale for it, maybe down the line, I may consider it, but it may just be one of those shoes I might have to pass on, man. As much as I don't want to, maybe the route we have to take, family, who knows? As you guys already saw, if you want to go check out the Cloud White 450 review, I'm gonna go ahead and link that right here. With regards to the dark slate and the resin colorways, both of them are gonna come with that super durable Ortholite technology right there on the bottom of the shoe family, as you guys can see right there. The Ortholite technology is inside of the inner sole and it exudes out to the outer sole of the shoe as well. This sole is built to last, man. And I'm not gonna lie to you, family. When you're wearing these, it really does feel like your foot is gripping the ground. And that is not an understatement. It really feels that comfortable. Now, the interior of the shoe, like I said, that Ortholite technology, it feels like a thin layer of memory foam on the interior of the shoe. Feels like, like I said, memory foam, the interior of the shoe. You have a sock-like fit right here. As you guys can see that sock opening. When you're rocking these with the 450s, as far as sizing goes, family, I definitely recommend going a size up. I definitely don't recommend going true to size. I wear a true size 12. Okay, I can literally wear a 12 in any other shoe for the most part, but I had to get a 13 in these Yeezys. Okay, now this is an 11. I had to get the biggest size I could, of course. This is a 13 in the cloud white, and it fits my foot perfectly. Toes feel great. Everything just feels mad comfortable, and it gives my foot that premium custom fit, if you know what I'm saying. But once you get your foot in, you know, is you're going to start feeling the, the sock-like knit, this knit liner, this sock liner, you're gonna start feeling it really conform to your foot. That way it won't give you any issues, okay? Now, let's talk about the colors, man. Me, personally, I love this black on black on the dark slate. It's really like a black on black on brown. Well, really like a black on charcoal on black. You got black rope laces, okay? And as you guys can see, similar to the 350 knit compact V2s that we reviewed, you guys can go ahead and check out that video if you like as well. The laces do protrude out of the Yeezy. Now, most Yeezys, the laces are gonna be inside of the shoe, okay? Meaning the lace holes, the eye stays are gonna be inside the shoe. This time, like on the 450s, it does come out to give your foot and give that sneaker that more sneaker look, if that makes any sense, okay? Let's see what else we got here, family. That's mainly it. Now, of course, on the back of the dark slate and the cloud white, for that matter, you're gonna get that contrasting brown right there on the back. You guys see that? Really, really clean, man, really dope. Same thing with the cloud white. You get that little speck of brown right there as well. I much rather have the black pair, but Unfortunately, I couldn't get it in my size, but yet again, I'm still gonna shout out Atmos USA for doing a completely fair sneaker drop, man. It was great energy out there in the line. Of course, the staff always friendly and always knowledgeable on anything that you need help with, so I definitely recommend shopping Atmos USA. Like always, man, it's my favorite sneaker store in DC, so I gotta shout them out. <laughs> it, it would be criminal for me not to. Here's what threw me off about the resin. I would have loved to have seen the resin color up top and maybe a white sole on the bottom. I would have preferred that over anything. Make sure you guys can see that, man, because it's a little bit bright in person than what you're probably seeing on my screen right here on your screen to me it just looks like too much going on a little too vibrant a little too loud a little just it's just a little too much for me it's just not a color I could really see myself rocking Adidas branding is all over the shoe family I mean when we're talking about Adidas logo branding right here right here as well at the top of the toe box it's comfortable you're gonna love it and I really feel like if you have not had a chance to pick up a pair I really feel like you should do so especially since these shoes released today the, the price on the aftermarket third market second party whatever you want to call it third party it has really dropped a lot so i recommend if you haven't done so family make sure you definitely take a look at these if you're interested the box is the exact same as the cloud white box family there's no difference at all 450 traditional 450 box easy 450 with the size tag right there and then of course easy 450 made by adidas on the opposite side all right so over Overall family, I will say good shoes. If you're able to pull off the resin pair, go for it, okay? The resin pair is probably gonna be one of those pairs that'll eventually be slept on and then everybody and their mama will all of a sudden want them. Me, I'm good on them. Uh, but like I said, shout out to my guy Milton, man. Shout out to the MDW family. And of course, if you're in the North Carolina, if you're in North Carolina or anywhere in general, y'all hit up my guy, man. He's a certified basketball trainer. He's actually, I don't know if y'all realize, but he's actually training professional athletes and people who you know, want to get to where they want to get to in the game of 
basketball and just in life in general. So I definitely recommend hitting them up. I'm just saying. So family, this has been today's look and today's review of the Yeezy 450 in its dark slate and its resin colorway. Rope laces, super, super thick. 450 Ortholite sole, man. Sock liner all throughout the top of the shoe. Really clean mesh sock liner. You can't go wrong with the shoe family. I hope you enjoyed the video. Thank you for watching. Thank you for subscribing. And of course, guys, I love you. I appreciate you. And I will see you in the next vid family. Until the next time, we're out. Peace.